Hey guys, welcome back again. Uh, we're going to be playing Murdered Soul Suspect. I'm going to be showing you the cat possession. Um, this game is somewhat familiar to most people who have played Square Enix games. It is also brought to you by the same people who did Deus Ex and Just Cause 2. Product placement. <coughs> Anyway, I'm going to be showing you the cat possession because, I mean, that's the only really cool part about this game. But yeah, you're this ghost guy and you can do really neat things like walk through walls and possess things. But the coolest thing you can possess in this game is the cat. You can make it meow and do crazy stuff. But my favorite thing to do is antagonize the people around me and they don't really seem to care and uh, normally when you possess people you can do mind reading um, but with the cat not so much but um, I can almost kind of guess at what the cat is thinking right now my cat kind of does the same type of thing in the middle of the night about three in the morning which I call crazy kitty time when she just kind of runs around and I kinda shake my head just like that old lady <laughs> they don't seem to care at all cat is like my food bowl is half empty I'm gonna die help you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pee on that favorite shirt you like that'll teach ya Oh my god, please pet me so I have an excuse to mangle your face! Where's the catnip? Oh my god, play with me so I can pretend to be disinterested! Can you please open the door so that I can stare at you staring at me? Can I watch you poop? My litter box knees emptied. Oh my god, look how adorable I am! Yeah, she's just shaking her head. Cat's all like, Can you please do the laundry right now so that I can lay in the basket and groom my crotch? <laughs> and that is the cat possession. Have a good night!